Darknet's Chill. And then later on, we'll be unboxing the prizes from CC1. And of course, we're stuck in Neural Network again. Right, Piper? Yeah. Hey, what's up, guys? Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. How's everyone doing? Hopefully well. You waited for no 5,000 years for this? Well, it, it took forever um, for the CC0 prizes to come in. That, uh, oh my god, I was like almost like two months. And congrats on first place. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much, guys, for actually voting for me. So, you know, your support. Without that, wouldn't have done it. So, appreciate it. Thank you so much. What are you doing, cat? My cat's just messing around. Your booty cheeks are a little sore. You fell down the stairs. Well, at least it's only your butt that's sore, right? At least you didn't, like, you know, break any bones or anything. And Lynx Jr., hey man. I think you're the only one on Twitch right now, but that's okay. And Morning Lynx, and thank you, thank you, thank you. Madeline heard butt. Oh, uh, well someone from the YouTube chat was saying they uh, fell down the stairs and hurt their butt. So, yeah, he broke his ass. Cats and Kinder, hello, hello. Why aren't they using Overview to easily swap operators? I'm just used to it like this. I've, I've always done it like this, so I'm just... I'm a creature of habit, you know what I mean? Oh, look at that. Oh, there we go. We're good. I think we got everything? Yeah, we got everything. Actually, I need to spend energy on these drones. I have a large bed. You love it? Yeah, it's like a queen size bed. I think so. Yeah, queen size. I think it's queen size. You just got uh, your Vulcan Indra ticket today. Should you use it for Indra or another Vulcan? Uh, should you should use it for Indra because Indra is harder to get. Because with Vulcan, you just need Defender and Survivor, right, to get that guaranteed tag. So, I would go with Indra. And hello, Mako. Hello, hello. Hey, Omni stuff. What's up? Your cat just fell down the cabinet face first. Hey, I thought cats are supposed to land on their feet. And how's it going, Madeline? What's up? Nighthawk, hey. Yep, my uh my night is going well so far. Recently had enough. <laughs> yeah, we'll do the unboxing soon. Just uh look at that sanity, man. It's full. We need to spend it. What do I think will be the next event? Uh, I'm actually not sure. It's 
The events for Global have been all over the place, so it's hard to predict. Really hard to predict. Is Weedy needed for CC too? Uh, I don't think so. And thanks, Obby stuff. Yeah, you just wake up recently, Mako? Because I think this is, like, what, morning for you? Or something? Don't worry, guys. This is just, uh... Sparkling water, okay? It's not soju. What's the new banner for EN? Well, right now we got Scotty and Chen, like the rerun of those banners. So those are the current banners for that. And a quicksand vortex. Am I a Kaobe fan? I am. It's 1 p.m. you just had lunch. Oh, okay, okay, nice, nice. Did I join the first anniversary contest? Are you talking about the art contest? That's the only contest I'm aware of right now that's currently running. Oh, it's definitely not alcohol. Come on, guys. It's, it's, look, it's, see, it's sparkling water. See? Well, considering I can't draw, uh, there's not really much point of me joining the art contest. <laughs> Best I can do is like stick figures, so uh, I, I don't I don't think that's gonna be winning any prizes. Was Nen the only op time limited time robber? Yeah, so far, so far um, Nen was the only limited operator for EN. Yes, that's true. Am I sure I didn't put vodka in the bottle? Oh, I'm pretty sure. That's a lot of vodka, if that was, you know, all vodka there. Zach, it's morning for you. Cool, cool. You guys are just all over the place when it comes to time zones. Where's the cat? Um, I don't know. I think she's off doing something. Any other game I play other than Ark Knights? Um, well, I play Genshin Impact. And then I also play Ring of Elysium, which is like an indie battle royale game. And I just recently downloaded Mass Effect Andromeda again because I wanted to complete that. Because, uh,. I think the last time I played it, I was only like 50% done. So, I wanted to go back, get that done. And A. Cole, hey, what's up? Rogue-like for next event. Has it been confirmed though? Because I know a lot of people are, are seeing it as a rumor. But is that confirmed though? That's the thing. How many Jessica skins have I bought for the rich cat? More like, I've bought all the skins. <laughs> I don't think there's any skin I haven't bought. I, I cleaned out the skin shop. Stream it, please. Stream what? Stream what game? See here, you can see here, I'll show you. Store. If it lets me into the store. Always stuck on neural network.
Am I more excited for Weedy or W? Hmm. Probably W, because I don't really use Specialist that often. So, I'd say W. I'm more excited for. Alright, so Outfit Store. Well, look at all that. Bot. Granny. Bot. Meteorite. Bot. Um, Silence. I forgot her name for a second there. Bot. Jessica. Bot. We go into fashion. Look at all this. All. It's all owned. This is all owned. I have all these skins. Even, um, what's his name? Even Daddy Horn. I got all his skins too. Because why not? I'm just, I'm just a man of skins, you know what I mean? Like, when they release skins, I'm like, well, sure, I'll buy them. How can I say no? Skins are awesome. And then, of course, I got K.O. Bay as the, I don't know, assistant? Yes, the, the assistant here. I was about to call her secretary, but it's like, this is, this is not Azuraline. You know me, hello, hello, if I'm pronouncing your name correctly. You know, I, I wish they, um, they kept those, uh, those level packs, you know what I mean? Because if you stop getting them at what, like after level 70, you don't get packs anymore? I was kind of disappointed in that. Azure lane stream win. Hmm. I don't know about that. Quit that game because that, that was just too many skins. Which, uh, you know. That, that really hurts the wallet when you need to get every skin. That game just had too many skins. Say your name? Well, all I see is a dot, so I'll call you Dot. Kind of like from Reboot, Dot, that character. Is it worth... <laughs> Do you mean farming coal? That's the first time I've ever heard anyone say mining coal. That's a interesting way to say it. I mean, you'll always need it. So, yeah, I would say it is worth it. Because, don't forget too, the, the drop rate for grindstones and locks of coal from these stages is like super high. Like, it's really good. So... Will I stream Mass Effect? Oh, okay, okay. Uh, maybe like here and there. I'm not sure yet. And Zach25, thanks for the follow. If I play... GFL. What's GFL? Just pulled Kobe or Kobe? Nice. Congratulations on your Kobe. You got the doggo. You brought her home. Oh, girls front line. Oh, okay, okay. You know, I I heard about that when it first came out, and I was like, yeah, I don't know. Was I didn't really get into it. Was never uh, too too interested in getting into it. I guess good thing I didn't. I'm sure it's a good game though, but nah. Echo Gen German. What? Are you asking if I'm German? So where's that Citadel name from? I should have known better. Oh. Yeah, that's where it's from. Yeah, Citadel is from Mass Effect. Yes. 
Thoughts about next event? It's a mystery. Next event for EN is going to be a mystery. We don't know. Like it, it could be roguelike, but that's a rumor right now. So it's unconfirmed. And CJ, thanks for the follow, man. Am I going to participate in the drawing contest? I have no drawing skills, guys. I can't draw for shit, okay? <laughs> I'm not going to participate in the contest because I can't draw. Like, W Banner will probably be sometime in um, January, I would assume. Like, January, February, if I had to guess. Like, that's that's what I think would happen. But who knows for sure. And Sozeron? Yeah, Sozeron is super cute. Alright, we're just gonna drop Silver Dad right here. He's just gonna finish off uh, Big Bob. All right, time for the swing, swing. <laughs> Easy clap. Is there a hidden criteria to get a oh, top operator tag? Yeah, the hidden ki criteria is that you offer a sacrifice. You must appease the RNG gods. That's how you get top operator tag. Do I have beeswax yet? Nope, not yet. I tried uh, rolling on her banner and uh, nope. Banner just said nope. Alright, so after this stage, we'll go ahead and show off the prizes from CC0. Demonic Force. Who's the following girl? Oh, that's a member of TWICE, the K-pop band. That's Chewy. That's who it is. That's who the, uh, the girl is when you guys follow and stuff. What's my shirt say? It says Echo. See? Echo. It's an Echo shirt. <laughs> How many Loxic and Grindstone I have? I have, let's see, that's a good question actually. I have 162 Grindstones and for Loxic, 106. So I always need more. What sniper should you eat to first? Blue Poison, Meteorite, or Firewatch? Uh, Blue Poison and then Meteorite and then Firewatch in that order. If you have to pick. So. Those will be. What I, I would say. Am I a fan of Twice? Of course I am. Twice I would say is my favorite K-pop band. Alright. Let's whip out the. Uh, uh, CC Zero prizes. Okay, so, so in this box here, let's see, I guess we'll just start with, uh, with this right here. 
and it's still got tape stuck to it. That's nice. Okay, so... What is this? I don't know what this is. Okay, I'm just gonna stand up for this. Okay, so we have some sort of, like, bag here, okay? And inside... Oh! It's a Lapland bunny! Look at that. Alright, yeah, I can increase the cam there. Make it a little bit bigger. Uh, hold on. Try to get that webcam. Where's the webcam? There's that better. See? Here, I'll make it a little bit bigger. I don't want to make it, like, too big. Come on, guys. So we've got the Lapland plush, uh, plushie, pretty cute, you can see all around in here. And this is for uh, CC0 by the way, not CC1. I haven't got the stuff for CC1 yet. Alright, so that's prize number one. Number two is, what is this? I'm not sure what's in this box. Oh, did the camera just freeze there for a second? Okay, there we go. Um, you know what? Let's open this box and see what's inside. What's in here? Oh, it's Scotty. Oh, shit. It's Scotty. Look at that. Scotty. That's cute. Yeah, so it came out of this box here. So I guess it's, I don't know if it's RNG because it, it doesn't have like a picture of Scotty on it, right? So I don't know if that's just like RNG or what? Yeah, I guess so. Cause I guess this is what you can get from the box right here. And then got Scotty from it. Nice, Scotty. That's funny. I couldn't even pull Scotty on a friggin' banner. Okay, so when the Granny event came out, right? Um, the Scotty banner was, of course, there. I didn't pull Scotty. Scotty banner came back again for a rerun. Didn't pull Scotty. Fucking pull Scotty from here. Jesus. What's the... Alright, we got a bunch of bubble wrap. More bubble wrap. Oh, this is the CC badge, I think. That's cool. Oh, I need to cut it, though. Let's open up the inside here. Alright, let's see if I can crack this open. Ah, that's nice. Look at that. Look at that. Fancy. It's like... It's actually metallic. It's not like a fake plastic. It's a van Vanguard token. Yes, Vanguard token. Cool. Alright. Oh, shit. Okay, we'll save that for last. Because that, that's a big one, I <laughs> think. Okay, so we have this just completely covered in bubble wrap. 
I, I do appreciate their packaging. Their packaging is really good for this. Like, holy crap, look, look, at, this, look at this packaging. Look, look how safe this is. Like, this is not gonna break at all. All right, let's cut in at this. Pop the bubbles. What is this, like a, like a bubble wrap popping ASMR kind of thing going on here? Like, actually, how, how well would you guys do it? I don't know how well that picks up, so... Anyway... Oh! Look at that! Amiya! Newspaper girl! And that's the back. Does trust give more damage? Uh, it depends on the operator. Not not all operators get more attack for trust. Some of them get defense. Some of them get HP. It depends. Yeah, this is the acrylic stand. Yeah, the acrylic stand, Amiya. Yeah. It's the donkey. That's cute. I like that. All right, let's see what else is in here. There's like so much bubble wrap in this. It's almost impossible <laughs> taking this apart because all this bubble wrap. All right, what's next here? We have, oh shit. All right, we have Hoshi guys. Hoshi, the Hoshi acrylic stand. The demon waifu. Yes, the Ani, the Ani waifu. Yes, exactly. Another six star. <laughs> that is freaking awesome. The the detail they put into these is crazy. Yeah, and it comes with her skin. It's not like her base form. All right, what is this? What is this? The heck? What is this? Alright, it's in some sort of bag. Oh, it's like a, it's a mat? Oh, is this like a freaking like mouse pad? It's a fucking Chen mouse pad. Look at that. That's freaking awesome. A Chen mouse pad. It's like it's got the feeling of a, like a like a foamy kind of feeling. So I think this is a Chen mouse pad. It's freaking awesome. Yeah, a Chen mouse pad. And she's angry. She's angry, man. She's angry. Alright, so that's the bag. That could be tossed out. Ah, this is the artwork for CC0. Look at that. Nice artwork. We got Zima, Hoshi, and Gavel. I wasn't sure who that was for a second. I was like, who is that? Yeah, it's Gavel. Pretty nice. Oh, I think this is the main prize right here. Like, look at this box. See what it says right there? The Bishop. Calcet. 
All right, let's crack this open. Jesus. There we go. Yeah, I think it's actually her. I, I, I see her in there. So you can see her in the side there. Right there in the side. She's in there. I almost like don't want to open the box because it's it's sealed. It's sealed like right along here. But like, I guess that's what the figure is supposed to look like. Like it's almost, I don't know. I think it'd almost be like crazy to open this box because it's, it's super sealed. Like, should I just keep it sealed? Like, just so it's like a, a true collectible, you know, unopened? Yeah, I think it's for the chess game, actually. Yeah, right here. It says it right there. Chess Knights. It's, so, I think it's for the chessboard game. Yeah, and you can kind of see her, like, in the side here. Open the box when she finally comes into the game. <laughs> if she ever will. Alright, um... Wow, that's, that's quite the uh, quite the division there, huh? Some people are all like, don't open. Some are all like, open it. I won't open it for now, just because it's like, it looks so pristine. That's nice. And that's everything for the CC1 rewards, actually. So there's the unboxing for that. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, minimize this down a bit here. Don't need this to be so big. I might open it later. We'll see. It's just, it's nice. So yeah, that's all our words. So we got the Lapland Bunny plush. We have the Vanguard token. And then we have Scotty the whale, right? The artwork. The Chen mouse pad. The Hoshi acrylic stand. And then the Amiya paper grill acrylic stand. So nice, really nice. Gotta say, like, the quality of this stuff is outstanding. And Tama, thanks for the follow. You thought it was a refrigerator magnet? Yeah, it's definitely not a refrigerator magnet. And Raito, thanks for follow as well. Yeah, that, the Chen mouse pad, that's like... like... Like, the thing is, like, the Chen mouse pad's really cool. But I, I would never actually use it as a mouse pad because eventually this would, like, wear off, right? So, I, I would definitely just, like, keep this. That way it's, like, nice and intact in pristine addition, like, pristine um, condition as much as possible. Itadakimasu! 
Well, I'm gonna collect them, but I'm not gonna sell them. It'll be a uh, hmm. It'll be a family heirloom. I'm gonna pass it down to my children, right? And then my children will pass it down to their children. It's it's gonna be like a family thing. You know what I mean? Well, because I already have a mouse pad too, that's the thing. Like I have like a nice razor mouse pad, so. Yeah, family legacy, <laughs> exactly. You, you got it there. Family legacy. That's what I'm gonna do with it. Cause these are like all nice collectibles, really. Like, like I, I want to collect these and uh, you know keep them. Yeah, I'd be like, son, here's what a top waifu looks like, exactly. I'll have to tell my grandchildren what Ark Knights is and how how that game, you know, came to be, and what the game was all about. And Toa, morning to you. Yeah, I'm sure someone's done it, you know. Cultural merchant, uh, merch outside of merchant that has been, you know, passed down to ki people's kids. I'm sure people have done that, 100%. Pull up your old video guides of the MPV format still supported in 27.7. Jeez. Pretty sure the world would be like cyberpunk by then. Most definitely Star Wars or Star Trek merch. Yeah, I, I can see that being a thing too. People uh, passing that down, passing those kind of merchandise down, right? And hello, hello, welcome to the stream. Just farming. Uh, yeah, you kind of missed it. I mean, I can do it real quick again, so. Lapland Bunny, plush. Alright. And then we have the... Vanguard token. That's actually metal, by the way. Like, it's some sort of metal. Probably aluminum, but, eh. It's metal. And then we have the CC1 art. Or CC0. Why does I say CC1? CC0. And then, um... So out of this box here, you can get, like... What is it? Looks like you can get Aya, Scotty, Laplands... I can't tell who the other ones are, actually. Like, you get one of these six in the box, right? So I got Scotty. Got good old Scotty. Right, and then uh, the Chen Chen mouse pad. And then um, a Mia newspaper girl, acrylic stand. Right, and then the last thing was the Hoshi with her demon skin, that acrylic stand as well. So that's that's all I got from the CC0 prize. So pretty damn good. Oh, and the, the Kelsic. I almost forgot the Kelsic figure. And I got the figure as well. So Can I take a photo of all the prizes and post it in the YouTube community tab? Yeah, I can for sure. Yeah, I can do that. And Nightmare, thanks for the follow.
Do I play Among Us? Uh, no, I don't. But yeah, those are the prizes from CC0. So thank you very much, guys, for voting in that. Appreciate it very much. Any plan to play any non-anime games? Well, I do play non-anime games. I play... Uh, Ring of Elysium right now. That's just like an indie BR game, like an indie uh, battle royale. And then just recently downloaded uh, Mass Effect Andromeda. Because I haven't finished that game, so I, I want to finish it. And Ligus, hello, hello. On top of CN news, do you stay? Wait, do I stay or not really? Since lack of spoilers, I don't really. I think I get what you're asking, Samuel, but I don't really pay much attention to like CN updates because I try I try to avoid uh, spoiling myself. First time seeing my face, elbow cough. Nice room, thanks. Yeah, Yostar shipped that stuff to my house. It took like it took a while though, because it's come from China, right? So from China to Canada, that's like what? Because of the COVID as well. It took like two months just to get this here. Do I tidy my room just for the stream? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I do tidy my room just for the stream. And yeah, we're we're gonna bully Bob here. Bully the big Bob. We're, we're turning big Bob into big burgers. That's what we're doing. Do I work at home or do I still go out? I work at home, mostly. Sometimes I go in for work, but I mo uh, mostly I work at home. And set to sub tier one. Holy crap. Set, thank you. Thank you so much for that. Appreciate it. Yeah, it took a while for the shipment, but hey, it, it made it. So, you know what? I, I am lucky. I, I feel very, I'm very humbled to receive these prizes, you know? Like, these these are just awesome. It's all thanks, all thanks to you guys. Couldn't be done without you guys. And Burr, thanks for the follow. How do I do low star all star series so fast? Blows my mind sometimes. Well, on the day it comes out for the event, I <laughs> I usually take time off of work so that way I can get right on the event. That that way I can get like the videos just out just like that. You know what I mean? And since I use my low rarity operator so much, it's like I, I kind of get like an idea of how how much they can handle. If that makes sense. Yeah, I don't know what the next event's gonna be. Hopefully, it's like. I'm kind of hoping the next events like in December is nothing too crazy just because like Christmas is coming up soon and I, I kind of want some time to just uh, enjoy the, the holidays and not have to worry about, you know, pushing out guides for uh, for the events. So, so I'm kind of hoping like the next event like in December will be kind of chill ish in that regards. And then sure in January just just throw it at us, right? Go crazy. But um yeah. Hopefully next event's chill. Wanna enjoy my Christmas uh, holidays and then January, let's go hard. Yeah. 
Lizzie has chain lightning? Yeah, she does. She has chain lightning. You believe the next event will be Dark Knight's memoir, but before the holidays? Hmm. Who knows? What do I think of Thorns? <laughs> I think Thorns is broken as hell. At least from the videos I've seen, the dude is just, uh... Dude just kills everything. I mean, holy crap. Am I Chinese? No, not Chinese. I am not. A lot of people guess that, though. But Chinese, I am not. Metalmar, hey, what's up, man? How's it going? You missed out on the uh, unboxing of the CC0 prizes. It'd be nice to have something for Christmas and New Year only for global server. Oh, like a uh, like an event that's like global exclusive. Is that what you're saying? And Moist, hey, what's up? Yeah, metal. Long time, long time. Are you, are you still doing your your uh, podcast, by the way? Ken. Hey, Dad, it's been a long time since I quit BNS. Yes, it has been a long time, right? Right, Ken? And thank you, by the way. Thank you for that $5 vote, uh, donation. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. You know what? Actually, that would be pretty cool, uh, is that if they had some sort of, like, global event exclusive. Like, that would be nice. I'd be down for that. Like, hell yeah. And Kamiki, hey, thanks for the follow. My voice is one of the favorite learning strategy with ASMR. Agreed, Echo Gen's voice is smoothing, no homo. Jeez, man. No homo indeed. And Hanamichi, hey, thanks for the follow. Yeah, that, that would be nice, though, because I, I think Global could use some of that. Global could use something, like, exclusive just for us, right? Because, you know, CN's getting all this love. It's like, hey, where's the love for Global, right? Like, don't forget about us. Got We got to have something, too. Uh, yeah, you, you are late for the unboxing. But I, I can quickly show it again, so no problems, no problems. And Subi, hello, hello, welcome to the stream. Mask Hero, hey, thanks for the follow. Will we ever get Peer Stream? I don't know, I hope we do. Peer Stream is pretty cool. I mean, Global makes some money, right, for, for Yostar, so, I mean, I think Yostar should treat us a little bit here. I, I know CN is their, like, big cash cow, but come on, man, Global brings in some cash for, for, for them. I think we should get some treatment, some nice treatment, right? Yeah, um, one of the nice prizes here... Uh, was the Chen mouse pad. That was one of the cool prizes. Chen mouse pad! Yeah, go work? Alright, peace out, A. Cole. Have a good day at work. And how's it going, Hana? And then the Lapland Bunny uh, plushie, that's that's like a cute one too. I like that. You, you, you can totally see it too, like, right? It's, it's Lapland. That is Lapland's outfit right there, 100%. Lapland.
And yeah, this is my new setup, by the way, with the mic that I was talking about here. I was using an old um, condenser mic before, and this is the new new whale new whale mic I got. 165. Always need more. Right, the plushie is adorable. It's super cute. And then they gave me like a, a Vanguard token. Uh, well, while you're in school, Maru, it's it's you just agree with the professor that way you get the best grades. Afterwards, you can then uh, you know do your own thing and disagree. <laughs> All right, zero, peace out, dude. Thanks for stopping by. And Amelia, hello, hello, welcome. But yeah, Ken, what are you what have you been doing, dude? Have you are you still playing BNS or what? Burger King skin. Burger King. That would be interesting, a Burger King skin. And Nacha, thanks for the follow. Or Nocha? Nocha? I almost called you uh, Nachos. I guess I'm thinking about Nachos right now, but yeah. Nocha, thanks for the follow. <laughs> I think we should get Tachanka because Rainbow Six Siege is like a U.S. company, so I don't, I don't think there would be like licensing issues. Pizza Hut, a Pizza Hut skin, that'd be interesting. Definitely would be interesting. What skill level is my Silver Ash? Uh, he's skill level seven, mastery one. Odd, right? Mastery one. It's like, huh. Random as, as hell, but there you go. Wow, Tizu. Yep, Tizu. She's the, uh,. She's the girl that uh, pops up when you guys follow and whatnot. Cremation banner? What's the cremation banner? Uh, I don't have Rosa. Oh, that's W's banner. Okay, I, I didn't know that was W's banner. Yeah, I'll definitely pull for that, 100%. Um, how many pulls am I going to do for though? I don't know. Probably not any more than like... I'm hoping no more than 150 pulls. Because I don't want to... Ideally, under 100 pulls. Just because... That's exp that's a lot of damn pulls, you know what I mean? So hopefully it doesn't go crazy with that many pulls for for W. I I'd hope not. Uh the poster behind me? Oh, that's a Star Wars poster. And Merxa, $5 donation. Didn't have a lot of time to figure out some of the CC maps after work, so your videos were a lot of help. Hope you're having a good one. Well, Merxa, I am having a good one, and I hope you are too. So thank you so much for the $5 donation. Appreciate it. Where's my Kato? Uh, I think she's roaming somewhere around the house, so I don't know where she is right now. She's probably chilling somewhere, sleeping on like a couch or 
I don't know. On a cupboard or... She's tucked away somewhere. She hiding. She's hiding. Can we see her? I don't know where she is, but I'd have to look for her. You know, cats are. Uh, yes, you did mix myth mix. You missed the uh, the the unboxing. Yes. Don't worry though, I will post a picture of it, so you'll you'll see all of it in the uh, community tab as well. So I will include that. You didn't realize my profile had a hat. You thought it was like black hair. Oh, no, this is definitely uh, definitely a hat, man. It's all good though. No worries. Hey, congrats on the CC video. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate the uh, the support, by the way. Why so many medics? Because Blaze is going to carry us. She can do all the work. Like, Blaze is going to do everything. She can do everything for us. There's two types of cat owners. One normal, two masochist. The heck is, what do you mean by masochist cat owner? I, I, I don't get that. <laughs> what was the reward for the CC video contest? Uh, It's like similar to what I have here, I think. I don't know, I, I couldn't find the re This is so f hard finding the rewards listed. But yeah, it should be really similar. Oh, we have a little bit of a leak here. I for I forgot my Blaze is not Mastery 3, so she can't k k kill everything in time, so. No worries, we'll fix that real quick. We'll put, uh, let's see here. Who should we put back here? Put Scotty back here. Scotty and a Granny. Where's Granny? There's Granny. Borrow Mako's Blaze. I don't know, is your Blaze gonna show up this time, Mako? Cause like last time I asked you to put your put up your blaze, she actually never showed up with all the refreshes. <laughs> Have I tried out E2 McGollin before? Uh I, I did, but I like never knew how to like play her. So I was kinda like not sure what I was doing with McGollin. I was like, huh, how do I use this McGollin? Because the thing is, like, since I uh, do a lot of, like, low rarity guides, I don't really mess around with my high, high rarity operators that much. So, need time to, like, you know, play with them and, like, see how they work. So, look, look, Mako, I keep getting, like, other people's blazes here. See, what they should do with the support system here is rework this. So, 
if they're going to limit this to 10 refreshes, right? If, if they're, if they're going to insist on keeping that 10 refresh thing, then what they should also include is maybe like, um, a wish list. You know what I mean? Like to, to have some sort of like operator or class that you prefer to get when you're refreshing all these, right? So let's say if you, if you want a guard, you want blaze, you can, you can select guard, right? So at least you only get guards in your refreshes or something like that. Or if you're wanting, you, you need an Aya, you can put caster. So you only get casters and increases your chance of getting Aya, right? Instead of wasting your freaking refreshes, something. Who's my favorite Vanguard? Yeah, definitely Zima. Is this my account? Yes, it's my account. How good is Granny compared to Vigna and Bagpipe? Well, Granny is like a balanced vanguard, right? Um, Cause like Vigna is like pretty much all offensive. Where Granny is like, she's a good balance of offense and defense. I put Blaze in the wrong spot there, hold on. I messed up the positioning for Blaze. I was like, wait a minute, I have Blaze in the wrong place there. All right, I guess we're looking again. Like, green is okay, um, but I mean, Bagpipe is obviously gonna outclass Granny 100%. <laughs> You want to stay longer, but you've been working all night. You need better sleep. Hey, no worries, man. Get some sleep. You can always catch my streams another time. Get some sleep. Rest well. If you intentionally lose a battle, the friends list operator automatically refreshes. It does, but only if you're actually using sanity for the mission. It doesn't count if you're um, if you're practicing, which is what I'm doing right now. So it's not gonna refresh even if I pick a support and fail the guy and fail the mission. Do I you always use my main account for guides? Do I get a lot of complaints when my operators are already over leveled? Well, most of pretty much all the events we're getting now is going to be relatively like requiring E1 plus, right? Besides the granny event, which was rerun. So I don't think many people are going to complain about my operators being over leveled. And plus, if this if the if the stage is like really low level, I can always just use my two stars, you know. I have my two-star team. Why is Scotty on that one tile? Well, if we get any leaks, then Scotty and Granny will handle it, right? They'll, they'll kill the uh, the enemies. Because that's all I want them for. Because this is just to show that Blaze will be able to, well, kill everything on her own. Am I trying to outdo my initial low starts clear? Uh, this is more just like a messing around kind of clear. I was, I was kind of thinking about it. I was like, hmm, Blaze versus Adam. That might be fun.
Yeah, she can. She can hit enemies on Hoshi's tile. See, and there we go. And Blaze is just gonna solo this. She's gonna take care of Big Adam, no problem. She could turn Big Adam to Big Burger. Yeah, well, I mean, she's taking on Adam with like four medics, but I mean, you, you gotta, you gotta admit, like Adam does a hell of a lot of damage, right? And Blaze only does physical damage, and Big Adam is, well, resistant to physical damage. Yeah, there we go, chainsaw versus chainsaw. Uh, I guess we could also do like an Ifrit version, right? Roast the enemies with Ifrit. Let's see, does anyone have an Ifrit in here? Or I'll just use my own, I guess, if need be. Let's see here, we got a... Damn. E2. E2 Project Red. Monica, nice. Okay, obey. Hmm. Guess we could use K obey. See how that goes. Curious. Pop car solo. I think pop car would get one hit. <laughs> she she literally would get one hit. She wouldn't survive. That's the only unfortunate thing. Do I think Vulcan is worth it on E2? I haven't used Vulcan very much, so I'm not sure. Um, but her cost is so damn high for Vulcan. That's the only thing kind of makes me wary about Vulcan is their cost is so damn high. Try Spectre versus Big Adam? Yeah, I could try that next. And we got a little bit of a leak there. Do I have beeswax? Unfortunately, I don't have beeswax. No beeswax. Wish I did. Here comes the lieutenant. He should just melt because of uh, KO Bay here. And yeah, I'd only E2 Katano if you don't have any other AoE casters. Like, if you already have, like, A or Mostima, then yeah, you're good. Just like, um, what T set there. Yeah, Efren's definitely broken on the stage.
And Nura, hey, thanks for the follow. All right, we need to clear up some of these enemies. That's a lot of enemies piling up there. Oh shit. <laughs> we definitely got some leakage. Ah, that was too many. Too many enemies piling through there. I'll use Ifrit instead. Let's go with Ifrit. We'll put on skill 3 for fun. And then we'll just stall with a bunch of defenders in that lane. And Dimas and Moon. Or D Dimas? Dimas? Dimas and Moon Mute. Moon Mute. Thanks for the follow. Jeez, can't say your guys' names today. Hey, if I use Durn, that'd just be way too easy. Durn would just wreck. Durn would be like cheating, you know what I mean? Oh, you serious? Oh my god. Okay, no no one saw that leak, okay? No one no one didn't see that that siege couldn't handle that in time. That clearly didn't happen. And Adam, thanks for the follow. My first six star? Uh, Angelina. Angelina was my first six star. Alright, so we'll try that again. Alright, this time there should be no leaks. Am I going to participate in the art competition? Uh, no, because I have no art skills. I literally have no skills in art, so... Definitely not. Alright, so this should be enough defenders to hold. And then, you know, Effort's gonna do the rest. Like right here. Just gonna barbecue all of that. Right, CB? It is pretty cute. Is asking for spoiler, okay? Like how fast Elysium is compared to. Do you mean compared to Myrtle, not Durin? And yeah, you could talk about that. That's fine. Alright, we're gonna roast the first lieutenant here. Give him that nice burn. Look at that. Yeah, I think you mean Myrtle, right? Not Durin. Because Durin is the two-star caster. Oof, there we go. Toasty. How fast is Elysium? That I don't know. Alright, here comes Big Adam. So we're gonna we're gonna cook up Big Adam here. Um how do you guys like Big Adam? Like do you, do you like it well done? Medium rare? Rare? Blue? Medium rare? Cause just just ask Ifrit and she'll uh, she'll do it for you. She'll give him the good roast. 
Bert. Miles says medium rare. Maybe it says well done. Well done, you don't want to get infected. Merxa, medium rare is the only way to have steak? Yes, I agree with you there. Medium rare is the only way to have steak. I like my steak medium rare. What is blue? <laughs> blue is like, you, you basically sear each side for like a minute. That's blue. That's basically blue right there. Uh, okay, how about we do this with... With Aya, I guess I guess we can do it with Aya. Aya Medium rare gang? Yeah. Yeah, see, the thing is with steak, I started out with well done. That's how, like, I grew up eating steaks. So that's all I knew, right, is eating steak is just well done. And then um, my friends, whenever they order steak, they always order medium rare. So I tried a slice and or a piece, whatever you want to call it. And I was like, holy crap what i've i've been missing out here so i've never never gone back since you know what i mean went from well done to medium rare Yes, UB. It's like rare, but even rarer. Yes, exactly. That's what blue is like. Like blue is the most rare you can go for steak. That's like safe. <laughs> you don't want to go any more than that. Otherwise, you're basically having it raw. How much was a steak? Well, I don't really remember. That I don't remember at all. Only support run? I could try that. Is Shining worth asserts? Uh... Oh, almost got a leak there. I mean... You can get by without Shining. Like, what, what, what medics do you have? Once AS skills up, we'll we'll delete all this. I'm just messing around these stages, just having some fun. You know what I mean? There we go. We scrapped him. Yeah, using Sanity to mess around the stage would cost me like 7 Sanity per run if I was to like quit before the stage end. So it, it, it would cost, yeah, that would be like a waste of Sanity for sure. Big waste of Sanity. And like I'm pretty good on like resources for the event. Got a lot. Alright, so we'll delete him. He's dead. 
<laughs> Deleted. See, she's just not satisfied with that Big Adam burger. Just not satisfied. All right, let's let's clean out these shops here. Buy all this intel up. Let's see. Uh, what else can I buy here? All right, let's get some of that LMD. Of course, we're stuck again. Of course. OCL, $10 donation. Or super chat, I guess. Your vids got me through CC. Now your low star also series is helping me with the night's events. Keep up the great content. Hey, o OCL. Thank you so much for the $10 donation there. Appreciate it. Helps a lot. Yeah, pretty much like with your guys like donations, I put it towards stuff that goes back to like streaming and making video content, right? Like like this mic right here and this arm stand. That was pricey, really pricey. But yeah, OCL, thank you so much. Appreciate it, dude. Yeah, I think for how many grindstones I have. So I have 166 grindstones and lock sick I have 106. All right, let's get some more. Keep getting some more. Yeah, this this event is really good for those two materials because the, the drop rate is really high. So it's definitely worth it. Who's the biggest eater in Rhodes Island besides from KO Bay, do I think? Hmm. That's a good question. Maybe Hoshi? Like, uh, like Mur suggested there? Oh, Durin? Really? Is Durin a big eater? I thought she was a big sleeper. I thought she was just lazy, you know what I mean? Or is it because she sleeps a lot because she eats so much food? She falls into that, like, food coma. A lot of people are guessing gummy. It's possible because she does cook a lot, so no, 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 that might be uh, might be true. You get bored of these stages. Well, I mean, when I farm these stages, I usually just like AFK farm them, right? So I'll I'll let the stage run and I'll just do stuff while in the, in the meantime. Like if I'm cleaning up my room or whatever. And I'll just come back real quick to check and see if it's done yet, and I'll just run it again. Kassa. Hello, Kassa. Hello, hello. Yeah, I'm not sure if you guys are, are aware, but I do have a Discord, so feel free to join the Discord. It's a nice uh, gaming community. Multi-gaming community, actually. Um, it's mostly comprised of Arc Knights and and uh, Genshin Impact right now, with like some other smaller gaming communities. But yeah, link is in the chat there. Feel free to join. Everyone's welcome. Uh, make sure when you do join, you react to Zira. So Zira bot has like the roles at the bottom there you can react to, and that's how you gain access to the server. So make sure you do that when you join. How are you going, Cass? How's it going? How's the Cass? Actually, I should... I should see who needs trust here. So I can kind of do like a little bit of like a trust farm, you know what I mean? Let's see, who's low on trust? Okay, so Vulcan's low. Hephaestus is also low. 
Sora, Indra, Lizzie. Just seeing who's like kind of low here that I, I like would use. Matterhorn, yeah, could use Matterhorn, higher trust. Gray, yeah. Doberman. I haven't used Ock. No, man, I haven't used Ock at all. I mean, you can see all all my male operators are like level one. Let's see, Ock is level one, Broke is level one, Executed level one, uh, Leonhart level one, Hung is level one, Flamebringer. The only one that's actually leveled is Ethan. Like the only male operator that's actually like has investment into him. Oh, and Bison, Bison's level one as well. So you, you see a pattern there, right? There's a pattern going on there. Does Echo have every Arc Knight skin? Yes, I do have every skin. Well, Castle Three is cool, so he he's uh he's invested into for sure, because Castle Three is awesome like that. And Silver Ash because he he's like an easy win button, so it makes sense to invest into him. What's my Discord server logo from? It's from Mass Effect. It's a picture of the Citadel. Ooh, close one for Grey there. Grey almost got offed. How many top operator tags have I gotten? Um, I've gotten like, let's see, maybe five or six in total. And like, I played since the game came out for global, so since January, right? So that's like, yeah, I think that's about normal, I think, considering. You'd rather have Aya than Silverash, especially with last CC. Yeah, because with with last CC there was a lot of um, like defense buffs, right? So yeah, definitely having Aya would have been <coughs> much more useful, for sure. And hello, Yanny. Hello, hello. How's it going? Who was the hardest six star for me to get? Uh, probably Blaze. The Blaze was like the most expensive one to get. Your cat is melted over your foot. Oh, your cat is resting on your foot then. <laughs> nice. You have a portable heater on your on your feet there. Can time limited ops come back like beeswax? I'm pretty sure the, like beeswax is gonna be added to the permanent uh, head hunting banner afterwards, so you don't have to worry about missing out on beeswax, because beeswax isn't like a limited operator. Whereas Nen. Right, like like Nan was 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 limited, right? But Beeswax isn't limited. She's just a new operator. Who would I think the MVP is for CC two? Well, I have no idea because I haven't I haven't looked into that. So I usually don't uh, look into future content ahead of time because it kind of it kind of spoils it. You know what I mean? Yeah, and Gray's a dude, by the way, for those that weren't sure. Gray's a bro. 
Yes, yes, you finally made it to the stream. Nice. You missed out on the unboxing though, but I can show you quickly if you want to see that. Uh, Yanni, if you want to see the unboxing for the, for the stuff I got. Some cool stuff though. Some cool stuff. And I'm curious to see how auto will play. I'm sure auto will be fine for this. You dare me to attempt an all-male op challenge run? Man, that's a lot of investment for me. Especially because all my male ops are... Well, not all, but like 99% of my male ops are level 1. So... That would be a lot of LMD and battle records I'd be wasting just to do that challenge. Am I going to roll on W banner? Oh, hell yeah. Of course. Of course I'm going to roll on W banner. 100%. 100% going to roll on W banner. I've been rolling on every banner ever since the game came out. So, there, there's no way I, I would miss W banner. Hell not. Hell no. Hell not. What the hell? Hell not. Alright, new face. Peace out, man. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, the trap medic. Well, because I I needed the trap medic, right? Like, cause he's a he's a three star. Kind of hard to do with only like one three star medic. So. How much am I willing to spend on W banner? Probably no more than a hundred bucks. Cause that's a bit. A bit much to spend on, on like a character an operator uh, okay so let's go over the stuff so the cute thing you might like here Yanni is we got the Lapland plush bunny look at that so cute right still in the plastic bag because I, I don't really want to open the plastic bag I kind of want to keep it in like mint condition you know what I mean but yeah we got the Lapland bunny Abyssia, hello, hello. And then they sent me the a Vanguard token because apparently I'm a Vanguard in real life. Uh, I don't know why. Um, but sure, I guess. Vanguard token. I guess that's a thing. Nice and metallic, too. If, if I got W in my first pull, I would be... I... I I don't know how I would react to that. Like, I I think I'll just have like a like a 401 error in my brain and just be staring at the screen if I pulled W on like first pull. You know what I mean? I just, I just wouldn't know how to react. And then for the um, so for this box here, so I guess you get like it's RNG who you get in here, right? So. We got Scotty out of that mixture. Out of all the possible um, choices for RNG in that box there. So Scotty was in here. Little Scotty. And then we got the artwork for CC1. So we got Zima there, Hoshi, and Gavil, all in their new skins, of course, right? And then this thing was neat. So we have the Chen, Chen mouse pad. Like this, this thing's damn cool. I I didn't know they had like mouse pads for uh, Ark Knights, but I, I guess that makes sense, right? Like, that's that's typical merch is they'll they'll have mouse pads, so. Chen mouse pad. And she's angry. She's all like, Ree. And then we have the acrylic stand with Amiya. Oh, and we've got a, a daddy, uh, daddy horn on the screen there. Let's keep this, uh, keep these runs going while I'm showing the stuff off. 
<laughs> yeah, the bitch, rusting bitch face Chibi Chen, exactly right. And then we have Hoshi, Hoshi acrylic stand. So those were all the prizes that came in for a CC zero there. Oh, and the, the cat's peeking in. I don't know if the cat's gonna come chill or not, but she's a. Uh, she just popped her head in the room there. Give me a second. I'll, I'll see if I can grab the cat and bring her into the room. So, oh wait, and and the the calcet figure, or calcet. So this is what it looks like. She's she's like in the box here. It's all like sealed, so I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to like open it. You know what I mean? Kind of want to keep it as like a collectible. So this this here was the main prize. Oh, the cat came into the room, so I closed the door on her. All right, let's, let's see if we get the cat on the bed here. All right, come on, kitty. Come on. Come on. Where are you going? Come here. Come here. Come here. See? Where's the kitty? Look. Look up, kitty. No, she's not gonna look up. She's not gonna look up. All right, here you go. Chill on the bed. Sit down. Chill. All right, chill on the bed. Okay. Can you sit? Yeah. There you go. What kind of cat? She's a tortie. Hey, Piper. Here, you want you want to smell the stuff? Here you go. Have a sniff. All right, you want to smell the plushie? Here you go. Smell the plushie. <laughs> She's all like, "What is this stuff?" Right? Here, you can you can smell the uh, the Scotty figure. There you go. How hard is it to take care of a cat? I'm asking for your mom, who's a dog person. Um, typically a cat is a lot easier to take uh, to take care of versus a dog, because with a dog you have to take them out right whenever they need to go out, like for you know to defecate and do their business. Whereas a cat, you just literally set up a, a litter box and you just clean it like what once a day, and you're good. Cats are much more uh, lower maintenance for sure. So. Yeah, and plus with dogs, you have to take them out for walks, etc. So, rest with cats. Yeah, you don't have to take them out for walks. Cats just lays around. Where's the cat right now? Oh, the cat's just playing with the bubble wrap. Cat name? Cat's name is Piper with two P's because we edgy like that. <laughs> Piper with two P's. Holds the cat. Uh, she is three years old, so she's still pretty young. I got her when she was seven months old. I don't know if she'll look at the other stuff or not. Come here. Where'd you go? Come here. Piper. Uh, she's sitting behind the chair right now. Yeah, that's that's how you spell it. Exactly. Yup, yup, yup. How hard is it to find your cat? What, what, what do you mean how hard it was it was it to find my cat? I'm not I'm not sure what you mean by that. Alright, Zet, peace out, man. Have a 
have a good sleep. Thanks for thanks for the sub, and thanks for hanging around with the stream. What's the cat doing? How is she? Oh, there she is. She was like under the table real quick there. Miko Jin channel when, right? A channel dedicated all to just Piper. Don't like cats hide in very dark places that the eye can't see. Uh, depends on your cat, I guess. Not all, not all cats do that. It's, I think it's easier if you have like, like when you adopt a cat when it's still small, like like a kitten, right? And then you just, like, the way you interact with it, the way you play with it, you know, it'll be more social. Whereas, you know, older cats, they might already have like a habit with them. It depends, I don't know. I mean, she doesn't really hide a lot. She, she kind of chills um, with like all the cat toys that I get her, so. She doesn't really hide. Of course, Maru, you should study hard. Study hard now, because it pays off. And then you can be lazy afterwards. All right, BSD, peace out, man. How much coal is enough? You farmed about 50 so far? Y y you can never have too much coal. O always keep farming, man. You always need more. <laughs> That's the thing. You always need more. You can never get enough. You get intel certs from buying the furniture sets. Like if you already have them, right? So it gives you um, intel cert certifications instead. Since I already did the event and I buy those pieces, it gives me intel certs. Uh, some breeds can be more lovable, so to say, like maybe more like a into like you know, sitting on your lap or being held and stuff like that. Like, like yeah, some breeds are more disposed in that way or predisposed. Where are we at right now? One hundred and sixty-nine. Oh, it means I gotta stop there, right? Because 169. No, I'm just kidding. We, we gotta keep going. We gotta, gotta keep going. Get more of the stuff. We need all the grindstones. Do you think they will rerun Granny Event again in the future? Maybe in the far future. I'm not sure how much they would. I don't know if they would re really rerun an event a third time. All right, Michael. Peace out, man. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, Gray is so close to death. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. It's just like it. it the cat will will form a habit based on how you raise the cat so that's that's usually the the easiest way to how you want the cat to be right so oh. I like the, the cat's having fun and playing with the bubble wrap i mean you, you can see the cat's like kind of behind me right there see she's behind me playing with the bubble wrap she she just playing with that because all like squish squish right so I'll let her do her thing right kitty a she cats a she what do I recommend buying in the Intel search shop uh, well let's go take a look at the shop after this run
yeah, Piper, I adopted her from um, from a cat sanctuary. So they basically, they basically just had this like building that they made just for cats. And there's like 30 cats in there and they're just roaming around in the rooms. And you know, they're all well taken care of and whatnot. And uh, you know what? She was the one, she was the cat that got my attention. Hundred and seventy, nice. Yeah, let's see here. So for the shop. I mean I pretty much almost bought everything out. Um I'd go for the if you're I guess I guess if you're limited, uh this would be my like prior like my priority, I guess, starting with um most important, so I, I go with the 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 keaton, the keaton right? The the keton. This would be like number one, is what I would go for. Uh, next, I would go for probably the sugar lump, number two, and then the orum dumb. And then from there, you can go for either the battle record LMD or or skill, whatever you're like lowest on, would be like your fourth pick. So yeah, so I'll say the the keaton first. Sugar lump, and then the ormdoms, and then the last three is whatever you need more. What? What do you want, Piper? Huh? What do you want? She probably wants me to feed her. Probably wants more like canned food. She's so, so greedy like that. Yeah, she's just she's rubbing up her, herself against the chair right now. That's what she's doing. She's just right down here, just rubbing herself. Hey, Kitty. Hey. Well, I, I don't think you can get the Intel certs if you are like if you don't have the furniture already, because you only get that if you already owned the furniture, right? So it's for people who have already, uh, who are who have been here since the uh, Granny event came out, right? What are you doing? Yeah. She's just messing around in my room, exploring. Cat doing cat things, exactly, Lynx. Just, just what you said there. Cat doing cat things. Is Big Adam's weakness arts damage? Yes, that's correct. A zero. It is arts damage. Oh, wait, Zero, are you in my Discord, by the way? Like, are you in there under a different name? Have I tried the Sozeron plus Lizzie comp? Uh, no, I have not. Sounds like an interesting combo, though. You don't really use Discord that much? Oh, you should though. Discord is like, ever since Discord came, or like was released, I like dropped TeamSpeak and Ventrilo and all that. Like Discord's been my life. That's all I've been using is Discord. You're a socially distanced person. Oh, okay. I mean, uh, we have some shy people there too. It's okay. It's okay. No worries. I mean, cause it's like, you know, if you have questions, you can always ask in the Discord, right? It's, it's a lot easier to just ask in there. Yeah, Discord basically replaced TeamSpeak and Skype. I remember using Skype back then, like with my friends. We, we'd always get on Skype and, uh, you know, when we were having our gaming sessions, was all like, <laughs> what's Skype, man? Skype's a joke now, especially that we have Discord. So Discord basically killed everything.
And uh, there's the Discord link right there in the chat. So just make sure when you guys join, you do react to the uh, Zero bot there. That way uh, you get the role and access the server. You remember Skype days when I was in high school? <laughs> yeah. Skype was the thing back then. Like, it, it was the thing. Um, let's see here. I've used... Okay, so I've, I've used TeamSpeak. I've used Ventrilo. Uh, Skype I've used. I've also used Mumble. Uh, I've used Xfire. What else? What else have I used? Those are the main ones that I can remember that I've used. I don't think there's any other program. Pester Chum? What the heck is that? I've never heard of I've never heard of that. I don't know what Pester Chum is. So clearly I didn't use Pester Chum. I have no idea what that is. I'm like, huh? Pester Chum. Yahoo Messenger? No. No, not definitely not Yahoo. Roger Wilco? Actually, I, I did use Roger Wilco, like, very shortly. Like, it was, that was very brief. Maybe for, like, a couple days. Shout out to the true vet veterans that remember AOL Messenger. Oh, jeez, man. AOL Messenger. That goes back. Goes really back. You're not gonna lay on the bed? Huh? MSN Messenger. Oh, yes, yes. Yep, definitely used SM, uh, MSN Messenger. Uh huh. For sure. That was pretty much like the main way for me and my friends to communicate until. until like Facebook Messenger was a thing. Then we, you know, moved on to that. You have a friend who used Pester Chum every day of her life. That's how she found her drug dealer or whatever. Oh, oh my god. Okay. Interesting. Drug dealer. Kitty, come on. Come on. Come sit on the bed. Chill on the bed. Come here. The cat just refuses to chill on the bed. Come on, Kitty. Come on. Here, you can smell this too. There you go. Crunchyroll was your mode of social media back then? Socializing on Crunchyroll? I definitely don't do that. I guess I Crunchyroll just for an anime and that's it. Just watch my shows and peace out. Why well, am I wearing a hat in the house? I always wear my hat when I'm in public. It's just used to it. It's just like a thing that I do, right? It's just when I'm at, when I'm out in public or whatever and I don't have my hat on, it just feels weird. It feels different to me. Kind of like how some people always like have like a, like a watch on, right? And if they don't, if they're not wearing their watch, it just feels, just feels off, right? So that's the same thing with me. The hat is just me. It's just, just, it's who I am. It's the way it is. This is the way. Speaking of which, I haven't watched today's episode yet of Mandalorian. I need to, uh, I need to watch that actually. It's a Mandalorian. Oh, 
now. I think the cat wants out. She's done. I guess she's done with the stream. All right, kitty, we'll let you out. There you go. Oh, thank you, Lofi. Thank you, thank you. Claire's 611 with Magallan. Well, can't really give you much advice there because I don't I don't use Magallan at all, so. Your door is next to your desk also. Yeah, is this like with the way I have my room configured? Um This was like the only spot I could put my desk. Which is like pretty much right next to the door. But yeah. Did I use ICQ back in the day to chat? <laughs> I did use ICQ back in the day to chat. I did. And I remember how cringy it was too because um, it was in 8th grade. Here's an embarrassing moment for you guys that I'm sharing with here. 8th grade, I added this girl that I was talking to. Um, she was in the same class with me, right? On ICQ. And she was she was totally flirting with me, but I was like so it just went over my head. I was totally like non receptive of that at all. Like I, I just I did not like play back with her um, flirtiness. You know what I mean? I I didn't catch it. I was just like, huh? So missed opportunities there, but oh well. Now that I think about it, I'm all like, damn, could have let myself a uh, you know nice girl there, but it's okay. Six eleven, tremor. Which which stage was six eleven again? Was six eleven that annoying ass stage? Oh, this one, bruh. This stage it was definitely annoying. Hated this stage so much. Definitely a lot easier with higher rarities for sure with the stage. Well, let's, let's quickly do the stage for shits and giggles because why not? Yeah, I remember doing the stage with my low rarity. <laughs> oh my god. It was such a pain. I hated this stage so much. Especially because of the uh, exploding spiders. Those cryo spiders or those ice spiders, whatever you want to call them. So annoying. So, so annoying. Let's see here. Who do I want to throw in? You know, let's throw in croissant because for the memes. Yeah, I know they're called slugs, but like they, they look like spiders. They, they don't look like anything like slugs. They're definitely not slugs. Hmm. 
Okay, definitely need to save up some DP there because, my God, I forgot how annoying that first part it was. Like Vigna just got deleted there. I'm like, oh wait a minute, I need to save up enough DP to drop both of them down. That way Vigna doesn't get shot up by uh, both casters there. Okay, so that should be enough. So we'll drop in everyone here. Of course, the Vigna has just let me down. Look at Melantha though, she barely survived. She barely hung in there. Yeah, they should be snails. Definitely not slugs. Most of like likely uh, trans translation issue, just like you guys said, right? So that's probably what's up. Yeah, the OTS in the stage is pretty nice. Agreed. And this stage is so good to have Lapland on because you can just silence them, so. Mr. Maketer, nice shirt. Thanks, man. That was just fun to mess around with croissants. Is that shirt or merch? No, it's not a merch. Echo Clothing is actually uh, an actual brand. I mean, it wasn't perfect. Probably switch out Vigna for like mm, probably bagpipe or something to get like a better better survivability. So yeah, she kind of got deleted there. Croissant looks funny used, but you don't have her. Yeah, I got her early on, but I never used her. But definitely fun for sure. All right, so even get this perfect now. Yeah, I hate the kind of stages where like it really forces you to like double drop or like triple drop operators. Otherwise, they get deleted unless you have like a super OP operator that can you know basically tank all this. <laughs> Still not enough. Guess I need to like. Okay, I need to drop someone else in front of uh, Melantha. Clearly.
Yeah, scavenger is basically an upgrade from vanilla, and they're they're both they're both very. What's the word? They're like glass cannons. Like their survivability is quite low because of their defense. Alright, we should be good now. Yeah, it was, it was a little bit close with Bagpipe there. Yeah, it definitely was, but we got it, we got it. See, we're good, we're good. Is Praminix worth investing? Uh, do you have any, like, debuffers? Because that's what Praminix is mostly for, for, like, debuffing uh, defense and arts resistance. Does Croissant work to build? I mean, honestly, I haven't really had a, a map where I was all like, damn, dude, I wish I had Croissant. Like, I've never had the user. Ever think of playing fleet fleet girls and gun girls uh no not really too many games to play I, I like to focus on just like a few games at a time that way i can like i don't go crazy <laughs> Hartman, you want me to do 6-4? Oh, 6-4. This map was so easy to do. So easy. Actually, let me take a look at the layout again. What was the layout of this? So... Uh... Okay, I have an idea. Actually, let me use my practice so I don't burn my, uh... Oh, H64. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, shit, this map. <laughs> I hate this map so much because of the RNG. The freaking Frost Nova RNG. That, that was, uh, that was annoying, man. God, I hated this map. Really hated this map. Ah, uh, okay, so let's see, how are we going to do this here? Hmm. Alright, let's bring in Chainsaw Kitty. I think I'll need 
Probably need one more medic. <laughs> yeah, use gravel. Let's see if I can do without gravel, because I have Lapland there. So Lapland should be able to silence most of the spiders. And Ernie, hey, thanks for the follow. I'm gonna eat some bread. All right, Zero. Peace out. Enjoy that bread. Oh, we got a leak there. First time seeing me stream? Ah, well, welcome to the stream. Let's go with that. Cutter has been announced? Nice. Wait, which, which event is Cutter part of then? Oh, that's what we're getting. Oh shit, okay. So I got some Dark Knights content. Oh, I forgot about those Ice Boys. That looks a little messy. <laughs> Definitely need gravel for this to, to tank all those uh, friggin' bombs. Otherwise, it becomes a big mess. All right, let's go with gravel. Where's gravel? Gravel, gravel, gravel. There she, wait, no, there she is. So they're going Dark Knight's Memoir, okay. Interesting. Dark Knight's Memoir. Very interesting. Alright, this should work out.
Did they announce when the event's gonna happen, Mako, or are they just uh, teased Cutter? Alright, so there's those annoying Joss drones. And then we'll use Sky to take out that Mortar Bro. Actually, Scotty might get taken out herself. Oh no, Scotty. Just teased? Oh, okay. There we go. ZML will finish the job. And then it should be Frost Nova next, right? Yeah, there she is. <laughs> Rip Scotty. <laughs> she didn't really get a chance to do much there. Yeah, Zima is whacking that guy with a fire hydrant. She is. That she is. Oh, Ripper Rooney on that. Didn't notice that. I was all like, who died? Well, that's not good, because I don't have Nero there. Hey, Tech Dust. Hey. Thanks, man. Was supposed to survive. Nero. Hey, Tech. Keep uh, keep up with your uh, memes. There, they're good, by the way. They're great. <sighs> Nero, Nero, Nero. Why why you gotta die like that, Nero? Why why you gotta do that? No dying allowed. That was going like a just a fine, and then top lane died. Yeah, I forgot to set Scotty on S2. I was like, whoops. Too late now, anyway. Alright, hopefully this time it'll be fine. 
We'll see how it goes. All these damn spiders. Alright, we'll use Zima. She'll just smack them with the uh, the fire hydrant. Actually, wait, the caster's gonna kill her, so. Apple pie be changed with blue poison? Yeah, definitely. Definitely can be. Oh, there's the there's the freaking ice bunny. The RNG. We'll just make sure uh, casters don't freeze uh, Saria there. All right, that that freaking ice bunny is getting close. I think she should be dead here. Well, actually, wait. She, uh, she will come back to life in a second, so... We'll knock her down. She comes back up. And, of course, she's invulnerable. <laughs> Rip. Perfumer. Perfumer just got... Absolutely deleted. You're back. Hey, welcome back. How's the bread? Oh, shit. Yo, take it easy there, Frost Nova. Holy crap. Her friggin' RNG is just a nasty. Holy shit. Frost Nova, please stop this. Apple Pie can't get her damage in because she keeps getting frozen. Oh shit, I can't place down anyone. Oh no. The 
pain of Frost Nova. Holy shit. Oh no, she's blocking those both spots off. No. <laughs> oh shit. Bruh. Frost Nova, why are you doing this? Oof, man. She she just literally obliterated everything there. Alright, so let's change just the skill too. Because that was painful. The summoner clear on this map? Yeah, the summoner clear is pretty big brain. Seeing like who else I could use. Um, let's toss in Talopsis instead here. Actually, I could use uh, what's her face? Where is she? Yeah, this will help right here. Or S2. Because at least that will reduce the the freeze status by 50%. Because that's ouch, man. That is ouch. That freeze status. That shit hurts. Be a dark memoir. Interesting. Okay. And that's going to be a major event, I guess. Hey Noah, what's up? Cutter is like low budget Chen. Hmm. I do want to get Cutter for sure. Got top operator, top operator recruit, and got silver ash. Nice, that's good. That's really good. I'm guessing you don't have silver ash. Yeah, you got blessed because you're watching the stream, so you got the streamer luck. Exactly. The good old streamer luck.
All right, there's the freaking RNG bunny again. That completely destroyed my team last time. Zima. Oh shit, I didn't see that frozen shit. Oh no. Oh no, that's bad. That's really bad. <laughs> oh my god. This stage, bro. I hate this stage so much. <sighs> this stage can go to hell. Stage is utterly annoying. I'll use KO Bay instead. But yeah, this this stage is like the bane, the bane of all stages. Well, I have, um, Kalon for that, so it's... Sh oh, I forgot to... Okay, let's pretend I didn't forget to block that one part. Totally didn't happen. So I definitely meant to uh, use gravel there to block one guy. And I was all like, oh, whoops. That's right. I'm not supposed to do that. Right? She's super useful for this part, since she can help uh, reduce the penalty for freeze. These mortars are also annoying. The Obsidian Festival was pretty fun though. I, I did really like that, especially with um, all those different OTS you could choose from. Like that was fun. Yeah, like what? Triple D. Um, what was the other band? I forgot the band names, but you know what I mean. The one Pang one. Actually, that would be pretty cancerous if the mortars did have freeze. My god. That would be so cancerous if they had that. Yeah, alive until sunset. Yes, that that was my uh, band choice. That's, that's who I went with. Alive until sunset.
I think we're okay now because we avoided a lot of the stupid spiders. All right, here comes Frost Nova. We're gonna do her thing. I'll let her move up just a little bit more because I want her to be in KO Bay's range. So we'll do this. Oh, we're good this time, see? This time we're good. Well, that was only the first phase, so we'll see. <laughs> For now, we're okay. Alright, now she's pissed off. Alright, we got, we got Scotty in the game. Scotty's gonna deal some dank damage there. Woo! Scotty almost got deleted. Come on, Scotty! No! Scotty, no! Scotty got frozen. Come on, please! There we go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Holy shit. Freaking hate. RNG. RNG is a pain to deal with because you can't predict it. My god. There we go. That stage is done. Done with that shit. Yes, yeah, Scotty definitely helped there cuz she she was able to dish in some damage real quick. While the rest of them was frozen, so... Whew. That was close. That was close. Alright. Gonna call it there, guys. Call it for the night. Since I still need to... Uh, click, quickly do my... Weeklies. Or not my weeklies. My dailies on Genshin Impact. And then get some sleep. Because I gotta wake up early tomorrow. So we'll call it there for the stream. We'll do the usual plugs at the end, of course. As always, so um, my Discord's in the chat there. Link is in the chat. Feel free to join. It's a nice Arknights community and Genshin Impact. Um, yeah, so feel free to join there. Chill with us, chat with us, ask questions. Uh, you know, we're, we're we're pretty. I think it's I think a, a, you know pretty uh, friendly community for the most part, right? You know, a lot of good people, a lot of good people. And uh, as well, if you ever thought of. Maybe you want to play Blue Stacks on the PC. You can always try out. Uh, <laughs> yeah, play Blue. If you always want to play, if you wanted to try Ark Knights on the PC, you can try uh, Blue Stacks. So Blue Stacks PC emulator. Um, you can visit the link there. That's my unique link. So if you go to that link for Blue Stacks and you you know download Blue Stacks and you install Ark Knights that um, will give me a, a bit of a kickback as well. So that's like also a good way to support my channel without actually like donating or anything like that, right? So that's another way to help and support me. But yeah, good stream guys. Thanks for being here. Um, you know, yeah, that's good. And uh, yeah, do appreciate your support too for CC1, the video contest there. Uh, I was able to get first, uh, first place for the rotating maps and it's all thanks to you guys. You know what, can't do it without you guys. So thank you so much, appreciate it. And uh, yeah, so have um, have a good night, uh, day, evening, morning, afternoon, wherever times when you guys are from. And yeah, we'll we'll see you guys later. All right, and Altari, hey man, thank you, thank you so much for the uh, tier one sub. Just just about to end the stream, but thank you so much, Altari. Um, 
Not sure if you're still in the Discord. I think you're still in the Discord, right? Yeah, hit us up if you're still in the Discord, Altari. But yeah, peace out, guys. And Altari, thanks for the sub. Have a good night.